Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Timmy Trico, also known as Horror Fan for Life. And the next movie I'm going to be reviewing for you is called Airborne. Well, this was released on May 11th, 2012. It is a British horror film that has a 3.8 out of 10 on IMDb and a 64% on Google. It had a $1.2 million budget. I don't know, I have no uh, box office numbers for it. Uh, but it was directed by Dominic Burns and written by Paul Cronel. And the movie stars Mark Hamill, Billy Murray, Simon Phillips, Gemma Atkinson, and Julian Glover. And this is a heist um, horror, British horror film. Um, what happens is all these, there's um, about 15 to 16 people uh, get on this plane and while they're in the air, people start disappearing slowly. Um, and there's something on the plane uh, that's also driving some of the passengers mad. Uh, there's a lot of crazy things going on in this flight. And besides all that, there is a murderer or murderers on this flight. And so it's up to you to try and figure out who is responsible. And um, I gotta tell you, I uh, I wasn't even close uh, predicting of, of who it was. Um, the first two acts in the movie are fantastic. Uh, the third act, when we get the reveal and everything, I think that's where kind of kind of goes down for me. Um, I don't know. I, I was just really expecting something different uh, for the final act of this movie. Um, I, I don't know. It, it, it was just, it was a, it was a letdown for me. The third act was, uh, cause once we find out who the, the, the big reveal is, I was like, really? Uh, I, I just, I don't know. I just couldn't believe that it. it's believable, but there's also another point in the movie where you find out, um, uh, who's in control of the plane. And to me, I just, I don't know, I, I just have a hard time believing that. But uh, for what it is, it wasn't a bad movie. If it wasn't for the bad third act, this would have been a fine movie uh, of, you know, who done it. Uh, but I think they revealed it too early. And they revealed a lot of things, I think, a little too early in this movie. Um, but I did, Mark Hamill was really good in this movie. He's pretty much the standout in this movie. I mean, it wasn't terribly acted, but uh, I did like seeing Mark Hamill outside of his element and into um, the horror genre. And uh, I really hope he does some more. Uh, I really like to see him in a big time budget uh, movie uh, like we got with uh, Child's Play. Of course, he was just voicing the doll, but uh, I would love to see him actually uh, in a big budget horror movie. I think that'd be great. But. With that being said, though, I will give Airborne a 6 out of 10. And I'm being generous because, like I said, I love Mark Hamill. And I did enjoy the movie to start with. But, man, the third act to me uh, just drug it down, in my opinion. So in the comment section below, if you've seen the movie Airborne, give me your thoughts and opinions. And did you like it more than me? Did you hate it more than me? Did you think it was okay? Let's have a great discussion about this movie. And let's have some fun with it. Uh, other than that, if you're new to the channel, subscribe today for more content. If you like this review, hit that like button. And share this review on your social media as you see fit to. But I thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for many more movie reviews. And check you later.